Hello everybody, I'm outside of Fresh Field Farms and this is where you can get um, fresh meats. This is a uh, meat store as well as a store where they also have fresh produce and all. Hi, I'm Ruby with Ruby Savings and I'm here to show you guys some ways that I like to save. I like to um, go to the discount grocery store. Definitely go to the food pantry because that saves you lots of money. Um, I like to come to the meat store, Sam's, uh, Costco's. I don't buy meats from there, but I like to pick up a lot of things from um, these uh, these clubs such as this here. I also have a new playlist that is out, and it's all about inspiration. So, ladies, if you would be so kind to go over there and to listen to some of the things that I share with you and check out these things here. It is just for us all. It's not all about me. It's about us as women coming together together in this place to be able to listen to be able to share and to be motivated and to learn more about who Christ is because we're the best thing that he has ever made so now I am going to go into Freshfield Farms and see what I'm going to pick up for today they opened at 10 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday and they had a line outside I actually had been here a little bit earlier and I was like, oh, my heart dropped because I thought the business had closed, but I was just acting early. So you see the people already in here shopping. I'm here just to pick up some legs, some wings. Well, not necessarily wings, but some uh, definitely chicken thighs and some neck bones. I did forget that I wanted some uh, ground beef. So I'm going to look over here and see what they have as far as ground beef goes today. I did go by the discount grocery store to see what they have, but my mind was more centered on getting uh, food from here. Mm -hmm. $6.19 a pound of fresh sirloin, ninety-two eight. I think I will get myself this one right here, which is $11.14. And they give me 1.8 pounds, so that's like $5.57 uh, a pound. Well, it's not even two pounds. Let me see. Wait a minute. Hold up. Because I might want to. I'm trying to find myself two pounds of this one. Well, I definitely know, but it will last me for a while. Okay, so since I'm going to do that, I'll just get this one here for $10.65 or will I give this one up here? Yeah, I like this one here better. So I'm going to get this and this right meat right here should probably last me about three different times because I'm just basically feeding myself. They got fresh ground turkey. The fresh ground turkey is almost as expensive as the, um, the ground beef. But look at it, it is fresh, and that's the good thing about it. Look how they have ground it up. That's why I like coming over to um, this meat store. I also like to get meat from President when they have it on sale, but I'm getting kind of low, and I really wanted some meat, so I thought I would just come over here and see what they have. Got the way over there, but over here they have different kinds of seafood. Let me see how much this guy is. Four twenty-five for a red snapper. That's not bad. And I, a high tuna steak. I will butcher a name in a minute. And these little baby shrimp are five dollars. And look at these jumbo red shrimp. I can't eat seafood, but if I could, this right here would be my best friend. Look at these breaded shrimp. Well, I'm passing over the scallops first. These breaded shrimp. $12.99 each. I used to like to buy the chicken tender strips a lot, but they got too much bread. But I didn't say they were good. They just have an awful lot of bread. Let me see what they got here. <laughs> Turkey wings for five sixty nine. I think I'm gonna get myself. Let me see how much these are back here. 
Um, okay, five thirty nine. I think I'm gonna get me some turkey wings along with those. Okay, and these two are already uh, split for you. So maybe I'll. That's what I'll do. I'll go on and change these to some that is already cut up for me. Five thirty eight. 551, 527, 430, ah, let me see, 452, 498, and how much are these, 654, yeah, those look worth 654, let me see what they got down here, oh my goodness, 377, okay, if you're looking for a deal, you just keep looking down, You'll probably find them. So, I think I'll get this one here for 538. I didn't expect that to be getting this much for you. My mom needs to prepare a little for us when we were little. Oh my goodness, I did not like that. But the gravy from it, the next thing on the bridge, man, that's what I'm going to talk about. The Thanksgiving is $34.21. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's a large pack. Oh, okay. All right. I, I don't think I'm still going to get it, but that's a lot of money. This steak here looks pretty good. I still have to take in my refrigerator. It might be maybe as big as this piece here, but I would have to cut it in half, um, slice it the long way. I had it, I, it wasn't the one that I normally buy, and I wasn't very impressed with it. So I gave my uncle some, and I said that I would take the remaining of it and I will um, fix it up for myself um, when I eat more of some. I still have ribs at the house. So, so far I have a ground beef, which is 92.8, and I have some turkey wings. This year is my Lando Florida. Um, I don't quite know the street, but I know it is off of Michigan Avenue back in that area in Orlando, Florida. She is 214. That's not bad. What is this right here? Uh, cheese is for what? What kind of cheese is this right here? Because I can tell that this is cheddar. Hmm. These people make use of every single thing, and that's what we have to do. We have to make use of every single thing that we have to resort, re reserve money and our resources. Okay, this here is pork steak. And you can actually take this and cut this up into different uh, steaks and rolls or whatever you would like to have. I'm not here for pork chops. I actually don't eat pork chops that often. And I do have some that's in the refrigerator. I mean, in the freezer from the um, food pantry. This is what I came up here to get for neck bones. I don't know if these come from a cow. I don't know who they or what they come from. But I wanted me a pack of these here um, to take these and boil them up. And sometimes you just put your little rice with it. And man, look at here, you just got to know how to do it. You just got to know how to put this stuff together, honey. So this is one reason I came over here to get these pork neck bones. I was looking for the beef ones, too. And then we're still in the pork area. Now, as you see, I'm waiting in line for my turn to be able to go over to get over to access the meat. If you're into chicken feet, here you go. But right here, they have a um, dollar two to eight a pound for these big packs of uh, drumsticks. I am going to get myself a pack of these drumsticks, but 
Normally, I like to go over to uh, President when they have the 58 50 pound. So, I'm not sure if I'm going to get those, but I really don't feel like cutting up any chicken thighs. So, I think I'm going to get. Let me see. I like chicken thighs, so I think I'm gonna get this pack of chicken thighs for two thirty-three. And then they have the smaller pack of chicken legs, so I think I'm gonna get a smaller pack of chicken legs. This four thirty-six looks pretty good to me. They're big enough, but I like mine on a little smaller size. So let me see. Well, I'll get these for. Did I get 470? I get 470. I have not been over to this store in a while because normally I go over and get everything for sale. But let me tell you, it has taken a while for me to remove all of that food, that meat out of my freezer. And I am so thankful I held on to it as long as I did. This month, I've had to extend my budget. Um, more, I only allowed myself a certain amount of money. I won't say how much that was. Well, I will. It was no more than about seventy-five dollars. I allowed myself um, this month to have um, just to pick up stuff, but because I've been going through my freezer, eating a lot of things out of my freezer, and my freezer is starting to get low. I have um, I have um, a pack of uh, ground turkey. I mean, ground chicken. Um, a pack of big two pack, uh, big pork chops. Once the chicken breast. Um, I get the chicken, um, ground turkey, I mean, ground chicken is six or eight, um, butter ball turkey patties. Uh oh, sorry, I'm in your way. Okay, so it might, yeah. Well, if I don't, yeah, if I do it this way, then I don't have to worry about breaking up anything. So let me get this pack right here for 244 and I'll have everything I need. And then these turkey necks. Let me go on and get a pack of these while I am here in the store. Mm, let's see. Well, they all look pretty good to me. They really do, but I'll get this pack of 204. Uh, okay. And so they have more pork neck bones. Now, let me see as far as the wings go. Let me get around this gentleman so we can look at these wings. Let's see how many pounds. It's 258 a pound for these wings. That's a little costly. I like the ones that's already split up like these, right? Yeah. Yeah, these are the ones that I like. Let me get these right here. It's two ninety nine a pound, so that's five ninety eight. Okay, I'm in people way. Okay, let me see. Um, they got wings all back up in here. Oh, here's a pack right here for five dollars and fifty cents. So I'll get a pack of those. Okay. And more pigtails. I'm good, y'all. I'm good on the pigtails. I'll leave any of those. I'm, I don't know if I'm going to worry about the chicken breast. I will see if I will get some. I like to get them with it when they cut it. Just put, uh, um, with you their, following me? Yes, I'm following you. You're right. When they cut up into strips. <coughs> Let me see. Oh, good. This is perfect. These are a smaller pack, so you can work just fine uh, for me. Okay, so let me see. <laughs> okay, this is here for for three forty four. I don't know. I don't like that little dot on it. Let's see how much this is. Okay, I got this for three sixty two. Yep, I'm set. So let me come over here and show you guys. Let me get out of these people away and show you exactly what it is that I'm going to be purchasing. Okay. So I got these uh, turkey necks. 
I came in here for three packs of meat, and I end up stocking my whole freezer. Okay, um, fry, fry your thighs. I got two packs of those. Uh, chicken tenderloins. Uh, buffalo wing drumlets. Some neck bones. Some drumsticks. Here's that other pack of thighs that I was telling you about. And here is the ground beef. So we're going to go up here to the front and we're going to let these people tell us how much these are. I don't know if I told you the I think I showed you the turkey mix and the turkey wings. Nevertheless, we're going to go up to the front and let these people tell us how much this is. Okay. Got to do a little bit of restocking for the new year. Okay, I have a budget about um, $40 for this meat. At least I came and started with the budget. Uh, once I hit here, what I realized that I was going to choose the, the neck bones, the two packs of chicken, and the... Um, in the ground beef. So we will see what I will pay for all of this here. And my total was 44.76. This meat should last me for a while. Guys, thank you for coming along with me and really saving the day. Find yourself a way to save. Find your way of, um, to put, a way to keep some money in your, your pocket. Like going to discount grocery stores, meat, meat stores, um, and food pantries. And when some of the bigger name stores have these different sales and stuff like this here, that would be a good time for you to go on and stock up with the coupons they may have. Guys, thank you. Have a beautiful day.